Testing, is this thing on? I'm about to run over my mic cable for, or no, my head, my headset, not my headset, my headphones. All right, let's do this. <clears throat> Continue. Hey, what's up, Cypherborg? What's up, man? Been a long time, huh? Or it feels like that. And I'm trying to remember where we're at and what we're... Oh, yeah, that's right. He was in here with me. We kind of need to go up. See, I'm pretty sure he's in. I'm afraid if I go in there, I might die or something, you know? Can you hear me okay? Is the volume levels fine? Wait, what? Just let me know if you can hear me okay. I really should do more test runs before I start streaming. I never think about it. I'm just like, alright, the stream will work. It'll be fine. Not a big deal. Alright, so the camera... Definitely going to be a problem for us. Man, I was in the hospital because of COVID, oxygen and shit. Hey, man, I wasn't in the hospital, but I had COVID. It sucked. It did. It, it did kind of suck. Well, there's no kind of about it. I legit thought, you know, I at least thought there was a small chance I could die, you know? <clears throat> Sounds good. All right, cool. I don't know if like I'm expecting like a big turnout or anything because I know it's Thanksgiving, but I figured while I could, while I had some time off and you know nothing else was going on, I would stream. I'm sorry you had COVID, man. I don't I don't wish it on anyone. I just had a coworker that recently got over it, so All right, we definitely need to reset the breaker. So I think what we'll do I need to get into that room. Or at least get in there. I think there's good stuff in there. We'll probably find the code on this super awesome computer. I'm sure it can play Red Dead Redemption 2 at like 4K, 140,000 FPS. Two 
2743. <clears throat> Happens to the worst part that anything I did made me exhausted, even taking a piss. Oh, yeah. Like, I'd be walking around. I'd take, like, like eight steps in the house or, like, outside or something and just feel, like, super exhausted, you know? What was it? 2743? Ah, shit. There we go. <clears throat> oh, boy. Wait, when did I get the noisemaker? I don't remember getting the noisemaker, but all right. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. All right, so I'm glad we have one. It's just I didn't I didn't know we picked it up. How's everything else though, man? You doing okay now? Are you still feeling the effects from COVID or? Whoa. Fucker dropped down right in this room. This guy's on, he's on some other shit right now. He needs to calm his ass down. I'm just afraid if I like as soon as I try to walk out of this room, he's going to drop down, like, right here. Still a bit sluggish, but luckily no longer a fever. That's good. That's good. Man, I know a couple of people that didn't handle it very well at all. Like, they... Even after, you know, it was out of their system, they were, you know, still feeling the effects of being sick. Like, one had, like, a collapsed lung. Like, another friend of mine, like, had, like, pneumonia and stuff for a while. Alright, we're gonna pull this. I'm gonna go over here and take a chance. <clears throat> oh, yeah, dude, I was... I think I was talking about that in the last stream. Hospitals, doctor's office. I hate all of that shit. And a big thing for me is the smell. Like, I just hate how those things smell. Alright, so we are going to try to make our way back down the ladder. And maybe save it as well. Look, it says that there's hostels nearby, but, like, literally nothing's coming up. So I think we're going to chance it. And we're going to save. So I don't have to do all that again. And if anything fucks up, well, I mean, I got... I got my trusty flamethrower. See, the, the crazy shit is, is I think I have to come back to this room... Once I trigger the other switch. Like, they got me running all over this motherfucker. Yeah, it's 
he says he's in here with us now. So we're gonna go out. Crazy thing is, is he can actually show up in like little vents like these too. <clears throat> It's a little more rare, but the shit does happen. And you're just like, fuck, I didn't know he could do that. I don't know why it doesn't occur to you that he can do that. But it really is the weirdest kind of sick I've ever been. Yeah, the weirdest kind. Like, the most shitty. It wasn't fun. Noth nothing about that was fun. That's, that's for sure. I need to turn this camera off, and I don't know if he's going to give me the time that I need to do so. Sick of all these damn cameras. See, a lot of times he pops up in here. That's going to tell me to go back. So you've been, you've been playing any games at all, or just one of those things where, like, COVID completely knocked you out and you didn't feel like doing anything like everyone else? Yeah, Zeno comes at the weirdest moments at times in your last stream, how casually it stood there without... Yeah, I know! What was with that? And I think in that last stream, as soon as I started the game, like, as soon as I opened up from the save, like, he appeared out of nowhere. Like, he was just, like, running toward the save location. And I'm like, whoa! Like, some kind of bug or something, but still, I was like... Holy shit. See, we're talking shit about him and he shows up. <laughs> yeah, go out of this room, you fraud. think he'll come back? I bet he comes back. Yep. He might have seen me, actually. I'm pretty sure the door just came down on his uh, tail. He probably heard me in here walking around. It's not a big deal. I was lucky to get a PS5 and an Xbox Series X. Man, some of you guys have been really lucky. Like, I just haven't been able to get as lucky, which sucks. I'd really like to have a PS5, but it's, it's not going to happen. 
Probably not for a long time. <clears throat> Played a little Far Cry 6. Oh, okay. Alright. I'm gonna save it. I'm feeling pretty confident. Yeah, but I'd, I'd like to have the PS5 for sure. Alright, this is this is gonna take some time. Hey Ziphos, what's up, man? I haven't played my PS5 in a long Man, everyone keeps telling me that. Everyone that was actually able to get a disc based PS5 or even just the the digital one, they're like, Yeah, I haven't touched my PS5 in months. Kind of a waste of money. It's collecting dust. And it's like, uh Motherfucker, do you just want to give that shit away, or...? Because I will totally e-beg that off of your hands if you don't want it. Alright, so... Medkit? No, we don't want to make one. I just want to use one. I spent... A grand on the PS5? Yeah, a lot of people did not pay MSRP. That couldn't be me. Like you wouldn't you wouldn't catch me doing that. Like I only want to spend the amount that it's supposed to cost, you know. I think this is what we want to do. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna bring him out. I'm pretty sure he's not hostile or anything. He might even be able to help us. We live in crazy times. I paid a little more than MSRP for both. I don't understand even now why. Um, oh, see, he's gonna do it for me. Why Sony and Microsoft still haven't put them in stores? You know, like you can only buy them online. Like, you know, they're like at a scheduled time of the day. Walmart will have PS5s and Xbox Series Xs at, you know, one o'clock. Target will have PS5 at 9 a.m. You know, like Amazon, it's not scheduled. It's all been kind of random, but, you know, it just sucks. Always going to be a Final Fantasy 16 machine, but I knew it was going to be difficult to get, so I had to get it early. I do regret canceling my pre-order. I pre-ordered my PS5, and I was lucky enough to grab one, and it was on schedule for delivery and everything about two weeks before they came out something like that or maybe it was even a week and i'm just like eh what am i actually going to play on this game what, what am i actually going to play on this thing ps4 games which wouldn't have been a bad thing but i like i overanalyzed it like i do everything and i'm like all right i'm canceling my pre-order i don't need this thing right now and i still don't need it like you don't need a game system but i do regret it now it does suck looking back. I should not have taken that route. Fine. Final Fantasy 16, I need that. What's this guy doing? I think I'm supposed to do something, actually. Alright, so... All right, and then, then we got to get to the other one, right? There we go. See, before I was doing it myself, I didn't know that he would help you. I'll be honest, I played through Days Gone on PS5, I loved it. 
being able to play without any issues was a blessing. Whoa. I think he's in the room with us, fellas. I'm not gonna lie to you. It'd be kind of cool if the Xenomorph would fuck up the... the droid. You know? Just watch... his white blood and guts go everywhere. That'd be kind of cool. I mean, it's not blood, but you know what I'm saying. Yeah, there's a lot of people still flipping them for a, a quick profit, for sure. I would piss him off and throw a Molotov at him. Whoa! Turned around and looked right at me, dude. I wish he'd leave. Thousand dollars ain't a lot of money to me, so I said, who knows, maybe they'll put it in stores, but everyone has their price. All right, so like for like, I would go slightly over MSRP, like maybe like six, six fifty at the most. Um, but. I honestly, I still don't even want to do that, you know? Take the freight lift. Shit, to be honest, I don't remember how to get back there. That sucks. Ha! <laughs> ah, shit. All right, so some things I forgot about this game, obviously. I don't know where he's at. Um, that's gonna get us nowhere but the same exact fucking room. Yeah, the the GPU thing's a mess too. Like the whole thing is just a mess. Um, shit. I'm trying to remember. Let's see. Uh... <clears throat> like, that's another thing. It's like, man, if my GPU craps out, like, I'm totally fucked. I won't be able to make videos. I won't be able to stream. I won't be able to play any games. I, I prefer to web browse on my PC if I'm at home. I can't see him. I don't know where he's at. Yeah, we gotta get out of this room. What is Xbox gonna do with these Bethesda IPs? Man, hopefully... Shit. Hopefully treat them right. You know, hopefully they're well respected and... You know... I need to leave, dude. Alright, so here's what I think we're gonna do. I can always throw a noisemaker and get out of this room. But I don't want to use one yet. I feel like I'm gonna need it for later, you know? Excuse me. All right, we're not gonna save it. Hoping The Elder Scrolls Six is done well. Yeah, I hope it's an actual RPG and not some, you know, strange crap that we got with uh, Fallout 4. Like, even Skyrim to me, you know, it's more of an RPG than Fallout 4 is, I guess, but it's just I don't think Bethesda knows what they're why can't I climb in this dude what the fuck is going on 
And you know what? I'd like to see Bioware make a comeback, but I don't know if there's any saving them now. You know, I'd, I'd like a the new Dragon Age game and the Mass Effect game to be really good RPGs and just quality games in general. But, you know, I, I don't know if that's going to happen for them either. People are going to buy the Elder Scrolls 6 whether it's a good RPG or not, you know? Because, like, the marketing's going to be top-notch. I'm sure they'll pay, you know, tons of money from the budget to make sure that the music is right. This really doesn't feel right, does it? You know, the Xenomorph will actually come in here and kill her. You can throw a... You could throw like the noisemaker, like a flare die. or something. This place looks safe. I still per yeah, I think Oblivion is better than Skyrim. I I absolutely agree. I I think that Oblivion is the better game. really doesn't feel right does it and then you got those that still prefer like morrowind or you know what is it like daggerfall or you know some of those games and that's fine too you know we all have a a preference like obviously i still prefer fallout new vegas and fallout 3 to fallout 4 i think i want to take this elevator but i'm not I, I'm going to be honest, I'm not sure. I don't remember where to go. Actually, you know what? Let's turn this camera off. I think we got to go downstairs, maybe. Moodle Moxon. Hey, what's up, man? Long time. Happy Thanksgiving to you guys as well. Where are my gifted games? Man, where's my gifted PS5? You're another one. You're another one that I was just talking about. Like, some of you guys have been so lucky to get one, you know? It's like... I don't hate you. But I'm super jealous of some of you. Do I want to go in this elevator? Take the freight lift. I, I guess. I guess I do. We'll do it. Wait, I made it. Is it still after you? I think so. I got a plan. Head for the labs. I got a plan. Mine is late. Not even sure I'll get it. That sounds about right. Like, everything that's of, like, a decent size is getting delayed for people left and right. FedEx right now is absolutely awful. They're fucking terrible. Like this guy. He's fucking garbage too. <clears throat> we are totally gonna save. At one point in this game, they take your weapons away, and I'm just like, no! No, you can't do this. Don't take my weapons from me. That's straight trash. I don't know who you guys have in Canada or who or who like the go-to delivery service is or whatever, but FedEx right now is absolute trash. If if you can if you can roll with UPS, at least in my experience, UPS is a better deal.
the yeah I don't I've never even heard of that like I got a buddy my buddy Terror Twist he lives in Canada and he tells me about like the phone companies that you guys have there and stuff and I don't know why like just being stupid and naive for some reason I had it in my head that you know you guys just shared a lot of the same companies like I thought AT&T was in Canada I thought Verizon was big in Canada T-Mobile and all that shit I just thought that it was like you know kind of like taking over the world type of shit or something but he's like telling me all these different like popular phone companies that you guys have there i'm like man i have no idea what the hell you're talking about okay we came through this door so we don't need to all right so let's make let's make a med kit we can afford to do that Another noisemaker? You can also do that. And I know I can't make flashbangs, so I'm not even going to try. Kurt Angle knows he can't beat me, and he's not even going to try. This guy got really fucked up. Of course, there's a key card required. I me mean, what state you in i am in indiana yes sir okay so just a matter of going through some different doors i don't know if i've ever actually been in there or not like i said it's been a long time since i played but i remember most things I'm sure it is. Huh. Okay, you look tired. What's the absolute best game you played this year? That came out this year or just that I played? <clears throat> Because if it's come out this year, I don't know if I've actually played any, like, new, new releases. This place creeped me out even before it all went to shit. Hey, man, thank you. Happy Thanksgiving to you as well. <clears throat> yeah, I don't, I don't know what the best game is. wonder what the kids are doing right now. Oh, shit. All right, well... He's coming, and this dude's gonna get fucked up. Can he drop down in this room? I think we're about to find out. I think we are about to find out. No. I, you know what? I don't think I've played New Vegas this year. I decided that I was going to take a long, long break from that game. <clears throat> Not because I hate it or because I got bored with it. It's just, it. it's at a point where if, if I take a long enough break, then I can forget some things, like, similar to this game, but, like, an even longer break, you know? So if I forget some things, then it can be kind of like new and somewhat fresh to me again. If that makes sense. 
And I haven't I haven't played New Vegas this year. I don't I don't think. So unless it was to what's going on. Unless it was to like try out like a a mod real quick or something. Oh my god, bro. I'm about to save this dude's life because I'm not gonna have much choice. Don't fucking say anything. Watch him get up and run. Look at this idiot! I totally called it. He's dead. What a fucking moron. You could say... I was a little shaken up. New Vegas is good, but pretty old at this point. <coughs> he was trying. He was trying to give me that... That pipe. Biomutant was pretty good. He's coming and he's cucking. Dude, this guy! Fuck you! He's gonna come in here again. I'm totally screwed. I'm about to die. I am about to die. I can feel it. I wear my sunglasses at night. I almost died. I'm totally pissing this thing off. And you know what? I do not care. Gotta heal up. Don't even try this stun baton on the Xenomorph. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. He's gonna run over there. What? That's fucking trash. Unacceptable. That eh, was bound to happen at some point. Well, I get I get my flamethrower rounds back, so that's that's a plus. I wear my sunglasses at night. I load my entire gun on the alien one time by going under two deaths back and forth that literally did nothing. Oh yeah. You can forget about guns doing anything in this game. And you only get the one anyway, so. And he wears his sunglasses at night. Alright, we're just gonna go and loot this room and leave, like, immediately. Because this guy's stupid, and he's gonna get us killed. And himself, which is fine. We don't care about him. What matters is, you know, if I live, that's what matters. 
Obviously. I can't trust anyone. I make my own way. Oh shit. Uh I don't know you, but you look friendly enough. All that for some ethanol? I don't even give a shit. At least show me that I could survive the alien without fire. He did forget about me at times. Alien is a slow brain. He can be a little slow sometimes. But right now he's not coming to get us, so we're gonna We're gonna make the most of it. Probably save that guy's life by not staying in that room. Need that flamethrower fuel. Look at that cereal, man. If it's those honey nut Cheerios, I'm all about that shit. Literally has the memory of a goldfish. Right, so we're gonna get in here for a moment. Because I'm pretty sure he can drop down directly into this room. <laughs> I'm going to risk it. We're going to come out. Cause I think that door is open now. Wear my sunglasses at night. Oh my god, this is gonna take forever. We're dead. We're dead. All right, somehow. The lab can be separated from the main station. Bring it back online, and systems can reconnect. Kind of need a save point, though. Let's go! Oh, this, this part can be kind of a pain in the ass. How many noisemakers we got? Alright, we got two. We are going to need them here. Yes, indeed it is. That definitely looks like one that'll grab me. I'm gonna take a picture of that. I don't wanna get grabbed. Might bring some unwanted attention. I wear my sunglasses at night. Let's save it first. Because this could or I don't think it'll take too long. It should be fine. I'm hoping we don't die. Obviously, there's no guarantee. But once we pull this lever, it's definitely going to be on. That's it. I can see a power spike. Now, reconnect. 
connect the lab systems to Sebastopol from the console in the central lab. We're counting on you, Ripley. Dude, I don't know where he's at. I do now. I'll just tell you, it's, this isn't a good spot. All right, so what are we supposed to do? Activate, okay. Yo, what's up, Blaze? Man, I bet you played this game in 4K. This shit probably looks amazing. I mean, it looks amazing. Shit, it looked amazing to me at fucking 1080p. So I can imagine, whoa. Happy Thanksgiving, man. Hope you're doing well. He wears his sunglasses at night. Go away, you fraud. Alright, we gotta make a move. Oh my god. Holy shit, he is like power walking now. Power walking. I'm not feeling very confident. Anyone want a xenomorph for Thanksgiving? Oh, I can cook that shit up. Okay, so... Alright, yeah, this is where weights totally fucks us over, if I'm not mistaken. Sorry I used you as bait. I wear my sunglasses at night. So I can, so I can see the xenomorph. Yeah, he's like watching me. Fuck. Oh, 
I don't know where he went. Holy shit. We can't figure it out. He's a little slow. Gonna do that. Fuck it, I ran, I chanced it. I'm glad she knows what the hell she's doing. <laughs> she didn't, we'd be in a lot of trouble. I could change. And you could change. Hello? And maybe everybody could change. Hello? Can anyone hear me? Ripley, is that you? Yes, wait. Me, you son of a bitch. <laughs> you locked me in. You blew the lab into space. I, had no choice. I would probably no kill that guy all. for doing that you to me. At the very least, I would beat him. I would beat him very badly. Use me as bait. I need to die. And it goddamn worked, Ripley. It goddamn worked. I got that thing. Jettisoned it into the gas giant. The station's safe. There's that. And there's the fact She did, man. Then it would be game over, man. Game over. We can discuss your methods there. Ripley hey Vasquez, have you ever been mistaken for a man? No? Have you? Hey Vasquez, you're just too bad. Vasquez wears her sunglasses at night. I want to see what's in here, so we're going to check it out. Ion torch upgrade required. Boo. Boo. All right, let's see, what can we make it? Yeah, another noisemaker would be all right. Let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, I think the original, hey, what's up, Sponge? Happy Thanksgiving, hope you're doing well, hope you're doing fun stuff.
pretty sure this is the like toward the beginning of the game where we met Axel. I keep this around just in case close encounters. Now, normally, a well-placed shot to the face of a droid with the shotgun is like a a one-hitter quitter. Whereas the pistol, it's like three or four. Even to the head. So it's good to keep the shotgun around, obviously. Where are we going? Take the elevator to Solomon's Galleria. Pretty sure it's not going to be that easy. Yeah, just hurry the fuck up. Ethanol. Let's go! No thanks to Waits. <sighs> He's a ruthless son of a bitch, always has been. Stubborn too. If he'd ever listened to me, things would never have gone this far. It's done now. I'm sorry for fucking up with the lockdown earlier. Forget it. You got me out in the end. I'll see you back at the Bureau. Um, It said that there was a new message, but it didn't let me read it. Sponge, you, you and your family doing anything for Thanksgiving? Or your mom cooking up a feast? Alright, let's get moving. See, I think this area of the game possibly you can run around, maybe? Like, if I run right now, I think it's fine. Yeah, see, I can run around right now. He's not gonna come for me. Have you played the GTA Tril Trilogy releases? Uh, no. Um, I probably will at some point, but I don't think that's going to happen for a while. Like, those those games need a lot of work. And until they get the, the treatment that they deserve, um, I'm just not that interested. I had a feeling about those games. I did. I, I had a feeling there were going to be issues. And I also kind of had a feeling that Rockstar was not developing. I think it was rumored, too, um, aside from that. Or maybe it was even con confirmed shortly before release. But, yeah. At some point, yeah, I'll, I'll pick that up. I, I love those games. I don't know if... Uh, I think I gotta go all the way back to there. Oh, yeah. I think they're all dead, though, is the thing. <clears throat> no, we're going over to a friend. Oh, okay, cool. A lot of work is an understatement. Yeah, I mean, it really is. Based on what I've seen, it's a major understatement. Modders are actually fixing the game, unlike Rockstar. Be kind of cool if I could just. Hey, 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 hey! This fucker, dude. What's that about? What an asshole! Come on, get him! Oh, 
And the Xenomorph is obviously nowhere around. <clears throat> I'm rerunning Vice City with some mods like Radio Restore. The biggest hurdle is occasional stutters, but yes, they are not worth the money. Yeah, I told everyone you're better off, like, you know, just playing the older games, especially if you can play them on PC and, you know, use some mods and whatnot. That's, that's the better way to go, at least for now. And honestly, I don't know if it'll change. I hope it does, but I, I don't feel too good about our chances. Or I guess I should stay, I should say Rockstar's chances. They obviously didn't put a lot of money into it, and we know now that they obviously didn't, you know, do any development of that themselves. But, you know, they were marketing it on social media media and stuff and on YouTube and whatnot as if, you know, this was going to be some huge thing and they were heavily involved. I mean, they never said that, but, you know, that's what they led everyone to believe. And I love Rockstar. You know, I, I still think in a lot of ways they're the best, but... They're also becoming one of the best at deceiving and bullshitting their customers and loyal fans of many, many years, you know? Like, how the hell do you think you got to where you're at, you know? I'm not saying that means they owe us anything. I'm not. I'm just saying it's something for them to think about before they run their company into the ground. You know, don't, don't become a Ubisoft. Don't become what many of the studios at EA have become, you know. You got uh, you got outliers, of course, like Respawn that are good and they're fine or whatever, but how long before EA fucks their shit up, you know? I was too lazy to install 10 different mods, one for HD radar cars instead of one install. Hey, I don't know if that means you're lazy, it's just... You didn't feel like doing it, which I guess could somewhat be considered lazy, but... I mean, it's just video games. I don't know. I don't know if that's being lazy. The only good thing about the remasters is, is that they're easier to mod. Is that true? I didn't know that. Bought Nino Kuni for $10. Man, it was a... That... That's kind of... Did you buy it digitally? I'm assuming you bought it digitally, right? That game's been on sale, like, a bunch of times at Walmart for, like, $5 this year. Physical version. I picked it up for five bucks, like, in February or something. Cause I wear my sunglasses at night. Alright, so... I don't remember where we're supposed to go. I think I was actually supposed to do something in that room before I left it. Is this the one that we were in? Let's see. Yeah, this is the one that we were in, I believe. Okay, so... I think we want to go out this way. There might be something in this room that we can use. Yeah, the older games are harder to mod. New versions use Unreal Engine 4. Which is a shame because Unreal Engine is a really good engine. And those that have used it properly and don't make their games look like every other game, you know, like it can be, it can be really nice. <clears throat> but the GTA Trilogy remasters just kind of look like in, in my opinion, they, they sort of look like, um, they look like the older GTA games in, you know, like Fortnite or something. <laughs> like they just look like the texturing and just the overall look uh, and the changes that they've made to some of the characters and NPCs, like the random NPCs that are walking around. I don't know if I care for it. I mean, I would play it and probably still have a lot of fun. You know, it's not going to, like, ruin my experience. But what is going to ruin my experience is just them, you know, not really giving a crap about their release. Well, I don't know when anyone will get this, but someone needs to keep a record of 
I don't really go to Walmart anymore since we've met to Cali. You should see people that go to Walmart over here. No good. Nah, man, I bought this online, Sponge. I don't really go to Walmart either, to be honest with you. Yeah, the older games. Let's see. All right, cool. So, restore power. I don't know how to get... All right. Obviously, we've got to get out into, like, that section. I just don't remember how. Because I'm trash. That's not the reason why, but... I mean, it's kind of the reason why. <clears throat> It might, it might also be because I wear my sunglasses at night. That could have something to do with it. Possibly. Item maxed. Whoa. Oh, we can finally... I can finally make a flashbang. Can I make another one? Oh, shit, son. Yeah, this was an online deal that they've had, like, many times all year long, like... It's like free shipping and everything. And that'll bring us out to... Oh, okay. Wait, isn't that... Alright, so we're gonna try going through here. I don't think this is what we want, though. I never see anything from Wario. What? That's weird. I feel like I was already in this room, and I was. Um, damn it! This fucking game. All right, it's it's not the game. It's totally me, but you know, Dead Space to me, they have like the best navigation system. You just push the the right stick in. And if you're a little bit lost, you know, it'll show you where to go. Like, if you want to go to the store, it'll show you how to get to the store. And if you want to go to where you're supposed to be for the next objective, it shows you where to go for that. I don't really need it in this game. I, I don't, you know, necessarily need something that's, like, that convenient. But, you know, people see these games and you would think that they would... You know, just, it would be inspiring for them to do something similar. I don't know. Um, shit. There might be something. I'm obviously missing something. <clears throat> I can run around. I keep forgetting. I don't need to walk all slow like this. Wear my sunglasses at night. I know we can't do anything with this. Maybe. Maybe I need to get it out of my way somehow. There's like a button or something. I remember there being like a droid in this room. Or maybe that's later. Huh. Alright, well, let me go back into that bar area. Oh, you know what? Actually, maybe it's this. I think we need this. Wait, it's Ripley. I'm What's an idiot. With the androids? Totally I retarded. Know. Too many games trying to be the same thing. There are too many games trying to be the same thing. Um, 
I can't make a pipe bomb. No. Charge it up, bitches. You want to try moving out of my way or? Oh shit, the droid. Damn, he Chudo chopped his ass. Fuck out of here. Think the Half-Life FPS experiences will ever make a comeback? Oh yeah, I'm sure. It'll probably be done by someone that everyone already loves to dick ride and everyone will pretend like it's new and innovative. You know, like they do everything else. Whoa! I'm fucking this guy up. Fuck with the bull, you get the horn, son. I wasn't even messing with that guy. He just came over and started shooting at me. Thanks for the shotgun shells, though. Can never have too many of those. Oh, shit, this guy made it. He's still alive. That's kind of cheap. He was on fire and he, he looked he looked all like burnt and charcoal, but now he just kinda looks like he did before he started shooting at me. Attention to detail. I mean it's a twenty fourteen game, but still. They might, but Valve really doesn't need it. If Sony has an FPS games like that, it'll get a ten out of ten and Jeff Q will give a game of the year like rad shit. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, that you know. At some point, somebody will make one. It'll it'll look a lot better than Half Life, and you know, just like I said, have really pretty visuals, and everyone will try to pretend like whoever that developer is was like the first to do it. Pretend like it's some revolutionary shit, and it's not. Kind of confusing trying to remember how to get back to where you're supposed to be. Because this takes us. Well, this doesn't take us anywhere. We came down the stairs, right? I think. I think we came down the stairs. Yeah, we came down the stairs. So... Somewhere, there's like a door that opens. One of these doors open, I'm pretty sure. We don't get games like God of War anymore. We sure don't. Oh, hello.
This is the door that I want. Yeah, I seen that, but then Jeff said that that was not accurate. So, who can really say? I mean, let's keep it real. I'm not saying that that new Ratchet and Clank um, is a bad game. I'm sure it's a really fun game. It's a, you know, technical marvel for a... A console game you know it, it looks incredible I'm sure it's really fun like I said but like it kind of came and went like nobody really continued to like talk about it like it wasn't you know like this isn't it it's not reaching like you know like Super Mario Brothers 3 or like Link to the Past you know Final Fantasy 7 or you know like a Naughty Dog or Rockstar game type of conversation and status I mean, is it really game of the year? I mean, what else came out this year? Like, Deathloop is probably a better game, you know? Like, um, let's let's go and look right now. Let me let me look at a list. Let me see. Twenty twenty one games. I'm just trying to. Rem I, I want to make sure that I'm not forgetting any games. Yeah, so like Metroid came out, right? I'm sure that Guardians of the Galaxy is pretty fun. Resident Evil Village came out. You know, I heard that that's amazing. I still haven't played it. Um, Call of Duty Vanguard. I'm just kidding. Uh, you know, Returnal came out. You know, I, I feel like that. You know, the conversation for that game lasts a little bit longer than Ratchet and Clank, to be honest. Um, I don't want to say Far Cry 6. Ratchet and Clank probably is a better game than Far Cry 6, I can admit. You know, Halo Infinite, the, the campaign for that, you know, it's still kind of yet to be determined. Tales of Arise, you know, like, where's the love for some of these games? Like, I guarantee you that Tales of Arise... I bet Tales of Arise isn't even in the conversation for Game of the Year on Jeff's show. That's what a joke he is. He's a fucking clown. Like, that whole award show is... It's just full of fuckery. All around. All right, I'm backing off. Hey! What? Dude, when was my last save? Oh my god. Really enjoyed Metroid and REA doesn't like Japanese games. This was my last save, dude? Oh my god. What a fucking joke. I gotta do all that again. What's going on with the androids? I don't know. I got the change of alert status. Damn it, I don't know. I'm trying to contact Samuels. Maybe he knows what the hell Apollo is playing at. Game of the Year nominees are Deathloop, It Takes Two, Metro. Yeah, like Psychonauts 2, It Takes Two guaranteed better games than some of the or Ratchet and Clank excuse me and like I said you know just keeping it with the Sony stuff like Returnal's probably a better game I really want to get Resident Evil 8. Like, I don't know how cheap it is right now. It's probably like 30, 40 bucks, but I don't know. I don't know. 
So let's make flashbangs. Let's try that. Make another one. Your mom makes flashbangs? Whoa, they already killed all these people. Why am I not holding a gun? Yep, see, that wasn't a direct shot. It should have been. Is this guy not helping me? he shooting me from? Remember Monster Hunter World won best RPG over Dragon Quest XI? I mean, I'm, I'm sure it's a fantastic game. Um, I don't know. It would, it would be hard to argue that. Um, I don't know. I mean, I'm sure it's good, like I said. Fucker. How do I only have two? That's interesting. Monster Hunter World isn't even the best Monster Hunter game. I've heard that. I can't speak to it personally, obviously, but... I have Monster Hunter World. I want to get into it, but like... I don't think any of my friends play it. And I don't really want to play it, like, you know, just by myself. I don't want to play it just to play it. Wait, for God's sakes, Apollo. Stone Cold never beat Red Heart. They're attacking on site. I don't know what the hell this is. They're not just responding to trespass violations. It's like they're hunting. For who? For everyone and anyone. What do you mean? Stand by. Why are you closing all these doors, bro? What does that mean to play us out? I don't know what that means. To end the show? I'll write it and we'll do it live. That's tomorrow and I can't do it. I'm not going to let you kill me again. Thanks for the revolver ammo, dipshit. See, now if I kill her, then it suddenly becomes a big thing. I've been playing Monster Hunter since the original on PS2. Every game after the Monster Hunter 4 is probably the strongest. I don't really like Monster Hunter. You flip through a lot of the things in Monster Hunter and the combat isn't fun. Monster Hunter Rise is a good contender. We'll see how it stacks up once the DLC releases in the summer. Do you think that uh, Monster Hunter Rise is better than Monster Hunter World then? Is that what you're saying? Oh shit, alright. that other shot. Not gonna use the pistol ammo for anything else. All right, good deal. All right, I, I think we're finally making some progress here. Which is a good thing.
No help from this bitch, obviously. Content-wise, Monster Hunter World has a lot more. From a gameplay standpoint, Monster Hunter Rise is the better game. <clears throat> well, I've never played one, like I said. It, it seems interesting. I have no idea, like, how the combat mechanics work or any of that. But like I said, it does seem fun. Maybe I wouldn't like it. I don't know. Am I not supposed to be in here? Can't even get into this. Uh Okay. Mm Is there no other way for me to go, or...? Even this door doesn't open. We're totally screwed. I just can't remember where to go. We came in that door. There's a safe point right here, so it's like, I don't... There's something in this room that I'm missing. I don't know. Like, I think there's supposed to be something with this. Combat is very do or die. Once you commit to an animation, it has to play out before you can do anything else. I gotcha. What? Door locked. Hmm. I don't remember what we're supposed to do. That's, uh. That's just, um. That's just five bucks, but, um. Damn, there's gotta be something. What the fuck? I don't know. Guess we'll go back out. I can't go over here. There's no doors over here except for this one, and it won't open. This woman's standing here looking at me all creepily, like, all right. Thanks for the help. 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 Thanks for the help. This door doesn't open either? That's great. That's fucking great, man. Now what are we supposed to do? I'm missing something. I'm... I've gotta be. Maybe like one of those little stupid, um... Little cleaner things. Maybe I'm supposed to activate them. Heading out. Enjoy your stream and Thanksgiving. Alright, you too. Take care. Thanks for dropping in. Do appreciate it. You can trust our working shows. Always there. Always helpful. Always working for you. Our synthetics are made to be simple. No emotional simulations. No Shit. How did I forget what to do next? Maybe it's bugged or something? Or maybe these chicks aren't supposed to be alive? I don't know.
Because isn't that... Yeah, I think I was down there. Maybe there's something in the floor that I missed. That's fucking weird. Alright. Guess we'll go all the way back. For what reason? I don't know. I'm trying to figure out why this one doesn't open. But I guess we're just going to have to go back, so it is what it is. See, I don't, I don't think there's anything else I can do over in this area. But, like I said, it's possible I may have forgot. It's fine, not a big deal, we'll figure it out. Ah. Wait, I've got some security shutters in my way. Can you open them? Wait. You bastards, you murdering bastards. Leave them alone. Stand down. You shouldn't be here. You're becoming hysterical. You bastards. Bastards. Wait. Wait. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Waits is dead. And now we don't have a door that's gonna get open for us, so that sucks too. Suck shit. You bastards, you murdering bastards! Hmm. So that door doesn't open. No entry. That's the door we came in. Get some loot or not. Maybe now we can go back up into that room. see what happens, I guess. Alright, so... Let's try to go back up here. We might actually be able to restore the power now. Maybe. Wait a minute. There we go. Yep, see the door's unlocked now. It's weird. You gotta trigger that. You gotta trigger that little cutscene first. you on that. Happy Thanksgiving. What's up, Hobo? Happy Thanksgiving to you, too. Hope you're doing well. You bastards! 
Nice. See, now that thing's out of our way. Oh, wait, did we just, we kind of just looped around, huh? That's all right. Did we restore power though? Uh, okay. I think we've already been in this room. Yeah, we have. Um, ah, does this open? It does not, but we can use this vent. I'm burning up like so much battery power. Like, I never use the flashlight as much as I have in this playthrough. Probably because I've forgotten so much. That's got something to do with it. I've been playing my first playthrough of Chrono Trigger. It's really great so far. Nice! Well, Hobo, I know you just came in, but I'm going to go ahead and cut the stream short. I might stream later tonight. Um, we'll just have to see how I feel. Tomorrow, streaming is going to be uh, likely a no-go. Um, just depends on how I feel. It's going to be a long, long day at work. And then Saturday, kind of the same thing. If I stream, it'll be a little bit later. Sunday's, Sunday's a possibility during the day. Um, a little bit later in the evening, no, but like... Yeah, a little bit. Maybe maybe some streaming during the day Sunday. We'll have to see how it goes. If not, then you know there will be more streams. I I definitely want to get to a game where I can pick like a story to play or something soon, and we can review that or whatever, um, and just kind of go from there. So I appreciate you guys hanging out for a little bit. Anyone that's still here, um, anyone that maybe watches this stream back later or whatever, that's fine too. Happy Thanksgiving, um, if you're watching on Thanksgiving. Take care. You guys have a good one. Peace.